What is going on guys and welcome back. So now in this video, we're going to be working over the new section. I'm going to come here. I'm going to click here and I'm going to hit um, this. Okay. And then here I need two columns, same like this. So what I'm going to do instead of doing everything from start, I'm going to come here. I'm going to delete it and I'm going to click here and I need to duplicate it. So here we go. I'm going to come here. I need to apply um, the background so that we just um, like change it, make it a bit change. I'm going to go to the background. I'm going to click here and I want to, I'm going to add hashtag eBay, eBay, eBay. So this is basically a create create effect that you should be adding if you want to add two sections right here okay um and here i'm going to change this i'm, I'm just going to come here i'm going to delete it and i'm going to also going to delete it and here i think i should add other stats about us okay i'm going to come here i want to change it to color of this to this okay um cool I want to decrease this till here. Okay, so here, what, what I want right here, I need to add some stats so that it uh, looks great. I want to come here to the module. I'm going to go down and here is the bar counter. So I'm going to add one. Okay, here is the title. So this title is going to be um, responsiveness, 24 seven support, 24 seven support. And the person is going to be um, 98%. Okay. And I want background. So, so here's the background. Um, I don't think so if I need to add any background. Um, but let's add the, it to be um, the black. And let's go to the design right here. The bar counter color is going to be the orange. It looks amazing. Okay. I'm going to go to the content right here. And here we have everything right here. And this looks cool. So I want to go to the text. Add the text, the title text. And the title text size is going to be increased a bit. Cool. Um, I want to add a shadow. Um, right here, right here. No, don't add any shadow. So then we have the percentage text. Percentage text look good. The border, I don't think so if you need to add any border. Okay, cool. Um... I'm going to hit OK. Um, let's come here. And what we want to do is that we need to basically just duplicate it. So I'm going to click here again and click here again and click here again. OK, we have three right here. I'm going to come here. I'm going to go to the text right here and I want to change it. So I want to change it to. Um, um, let's come here and let's change this to. OK, I want to add. I want to change this as well. So I want to come here and it should be. OK. Let's come here again. Okay, this is this has been applied now. So I want to come here, right here. Let's just click here. So everything is okay and editable from here. So this is going to be hmm, packaging, I think. What is happening? Okay, I want to come here. I want to hit save right here. Okay, and then I want to just refresh this because um, this is making some stuff here. So let's go ahead, let's hit save. Okay, it is safe. I'm gonna come here and I'm gonna just refresh this right now. So this is just um, doing some stuff. I don't know what is happening to this. Let's let's just refresh this so that everything looks okay. So I'm gonna come here to this guy right here. Let's just come here, let's click here again. And here we want to edit this. So I'm gonna come here to the settings right here. The 24 7 support is going to be um, packaging, package, and this is going to be 86%. Um, okay, um, now we're done. Okay, so, so let's just come here and let's just manage this as well. Let's come here and let's change this to be 24 7 support. So it is going to be. Um, Um, products or um, creativeness okay and this is going to be 72% um, here we go I'm just gonna click here and I'm gonna hit this right here and let's come here and let's save it so you can see that we're also done with this I think um, we need uh, a call to action right here below so that it separates it because um, it is uh, it is 
it is just uh, matching this or we can do one more thing what we can do we can just bring it here and bring this right here so that it doesn't match with each other we can do it like that as well um, but let's add a call to action right here let's click regular okay and let's just add this guy right here and here we need to add a call to action so I'm gonna click here I'm gonna come here and I want to click this guy right here so now I'm gonna go to the design the background and here I'm gonna choose a, uh, an image right here I'm gonna choose any image let's add uh, this image okay I'm gonna click here and here we go this image is coming right here I want to choose use the parallax effect so that if we if I just move my page you can see that the image is moving but if you want to add a parallax effect then you have to do one thing and that is make sure that when you add the image you add it right here you add an overlay before applying it so how you can add an overlay what you can do you, you can just come here and then you can do you have to just click add new layer okay so this layer is gonna appear you have to just press alter and backspace okay and this is coming right this is coming right here so what I'm gonna do right now I'm just gonna come here and I'm gonna click here to fill and I want to decrease it a bit okay like this and you can see uh, this is like this so you have to just save it then and then you can um, just add it right here and then you can apply the parallax effect so here I'm gonna I can add anything um, I'm gonna come here and we'll be adding uh, some more stuff in here in the next video so you can see um, our about us page is already looking amazing so thanks a lot guys for watching this till here stay tuned and bye bye